our leadership here, Chris Hillman, if you've ever heard him talk, you know how passionate he is about taking care of our employees and our residents. And he really empowered us along with a, a James Childers, our assistant city manager, to to think outside the box. And so our HR director, Jill McAdams, really got to thinking and started asking around about how can we really help think outside the box and get some of these, these people to work that were especially initially impacted by COVID-19. question came out, you know, could we use some help from other city staffers? And I immediately said yes, because there's always work to do around here. And they're helping us with laundry, dishes, uh, projects, different cleaning things, and having them here is a huge help for us. Mainly after all of this was going down, there was so much that was on my mind as well, where I was like, what should I do now? Just keep myself positive, keep myself going, and motivated. It's a good time to pull those people together and, um, and, you know, take care of business, take care of certain needs that might not otherwise be accomplished, especially in a time where it's good to stay busy, keep our minds off of all the craziness that's going on around us and just focus. And so that's a lot of it as well. As you know, the city of Irving is a strong community. Uh, they do what's best for their community and their people. And the people love that. When they see me out or see any other of the workers out, um, they come up and thank us for our help and thank us for the things that we're constantly providing for the city. The main takeaway for us with what we would like them to know is that we're extremely grateful for their service. And um, we're really here to help them along the way while we all get through you know, these challenging times and hopefully come out on the other side in a much better place. Although it may be a little different, it will certainly be a better place when things have settled down and we can all get back to work.